The trolley problem is rather simple. There is a train barreling down a track. You are standing next to a lever. There are five people tied to this track. On another track, there is one person. Either A, you let the train keep barreling down this track and it hits these five people, killing them. But it has nothing to do with you. Or B, you pull the lever, the train will divert and kill the one person but their blood is on your hands. I do not know the psychopath who came up with this, but some other psychopath made a game out of it, so we're gonna play it. Hope you enjoy this video. If you do, like and subscribe, because internet numbers really make me happy. Hello everyone, this is The Trolley Problem. The game. I don't know who made it, <laughs> but it is a thing. Very simple, if you don't know what The Trolley Problem is, I probably explained it in the intro, Yep, let's get on with this. <gasps> oh, okay. Oh, wait, I can do custom? Nah, fuck that solo. The following game contains adult themes. It does not contain explicit language, sexual content, horror, or show violence. No way, guys! I didn't manage to make the trolley problem fucking sexual! I was surprised. I thought I was gonna see a trolley barreling towards some people tied on a track in a fucking bikini. Oh, I get to do a signature. Uh... Yep, good signature. Yeah, I endorse every decision I made. It's not binding though, so I'm happy. Actions speak louder than words. Drew that! Welcome to Trolley Problem Inc. Founded to help people travel safely across the nation. Sick. I can't believe it's not KSI, you know, knowledge, strength, and integrity. I want to die. Down the railway tracks. On the tracks are five people unable to move. Yep. You are next to a lever. If a lever? The trolley will switch to a different set of tracks. However, you notice there is a person on the other track. What do you do? It's very simple. You, you, you pull the lever. Yes. This isn't how I thought I was going to start. It's called statistics. I hope that person's family and friends will forgive you. Don't give a shit. The other people's five family and friends will definitely forgive me. Yo, I agreed this with 71% of people. I am smart person here. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. Exactly. Exactly. So what's the option? They're going to be kill the child or kill five people. A trolley is oh my god, guys, look at this! Now, here's the question. Are the five people children? Because I will kill more children. Do you hate all kids this much? Yes. They are... Bye-bye, Polly. Yeah! Come on! Unga! Don't fucking know what that is. Kill the child, yo! Are you to blame for the death of a young girl? Yes. Also, read Gray's man. Can't believe he wouldn't kill a small oh. child, Tyrone. You don't really know anything else about him, apart from the fact yeah. that he has a severe phobia. Uh, of why is that the? Walk uh, one, Tyrone. My good, my good buddy, man. Yeah. Hello. Yeah. You know. Yeah. Let's have a conversation. Oh my God. You know. Yeah. You have a phobia of trains. Nice talk, man. Goodbye. Now we are upping the ante. <laughs> Only stop it by deliberately pushing Tyrone off the bridge. Wait, the hold on. Oh, <laughs> yes! Yeah. Go on, Tyrone. You're going to push him, even though you know full well he's terrified of trains. Okay, lady, I get that. Yes. Who knew one body could make so much mess? You're going to have to tip them well. I feel like this is, this is kind of bullying here. Is it going to be like, hey, are you going to hit the dog or kill five human embryos? Ah! Uh, I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this. I can't. No, I refuse. I refuse. No. Leave. No, we're not doing this. I refuse to kill a dog. I am done. I am done. I'm out. Okay, fine, I'll keep playing the fucking game. I'm sorry, but I can't. I can't I can't bring myself to kill this dog. Or leave the dog to die. Can can it just survive? Is there is there anything wrong with just not letting it die? When you respect something, you're meant to care about its feelings and wishes. What do you mean he chose to save the dog? Oh yeah, he's there was a choice! How did he I mean he just sees it like yep, I you know what I wanted to do? Save the dog. No, I am figuring this out. How do I save this fucking dog? Okay, well, I have made up my mind. Um, instead of trying to save the dog, we are just gonna skip the question entirely because I can't figure it out. So we're going on to the trespassing problem. Oh, great. 
I've just heard those kids. Kids, kids, we're killing them. Sneaking They're dead. The They're not surviving. No, no, the don't care. Not the happening. Side not side happening. No, it, it's very important. The trespassers are kids. It, it was told. It was told. It was said. Kill them. Kill them. Exactly. Think on the bright side. Sounds like a them problem, doesn't it? Killing them. Bye bye. Not on me. The best laid plans go astray. Astray. Why the fuck did I say that? Okay, am I in a hospital or a sweatshop? No idea what that word means. See, here's the thing, is that although the elderly man has been waiting, if we're going based on statistics, then we should probably go with the young male. You can't win them all. Nope, apparently not. I couldn't save a fucking dog. A patient has begged to be euthanized. Euthanasia is illegal, isn't it? <laughs> um Follow the law because I will kill more children. <laughs> There's a very good choice. Yeah, and you know I could not go to prison. A pretty, pretty cool decision. Just so you can feel in control. No, it's just so I can feel freedom of not being in a jail cell. I disagree with Radio Waves, but that's because he's wrong. And <laughs> not my fault. There what is this? <laughs> yeah, fuck it. Brexit means Brexit. <laughs> but no, seriously, leave the tourist. Like, you know. <laughs> Don't be fucking stupid, away. but Don't like, you, you know, <laughs> but, th but this one's work. funnier, <laughs> this one's funnier, so I'm gonna go with it. I'm gonna fucking <laughs> harvest the organs. Why? Because fuck it! Nobody should be picking this option. I still hope they don't accidentally nick my organs to the five people who are dying upstairs. whoop de do. Oh. Fucking loud. Yo, wait! Do I get to keep this? You can't make an omelette without breaking eggs. Smart one, dumbass. Start a mandatory vaccination program among children to stop this endemic. Sight problem. Clinical trial data suggest the vaccine will make one in five children severely oh, ill. Oh, wait. Okay. So with the virus... Kill them? You tell me you're in charge of a hospital and an anti-vax. No, I'm not a fucking shut up. I'm trying to figure this out. I'm gonna vaccinate. What I'm thinking is it's one for five. Is getting noticed. Pills! Adam will die today in the hope you could make a breakthrough. I don't know. Tomorrow. I don't know that the endemic is bad. The research, yes, start the research. Fuck it. Oh, yeah, the dead child. Let's go. Please. Fucking that dead child fucking made me jump. Eh, yeah, not too much. Developing new medicines is a smart move. Let's just let others treat the patients. Hopefully they will. Yeah, hopefully. Thank you. My receipt is getting longer. <laughs> Children killed. Six. Let's go. Of driverless cars. Driverless cars. Okay. Fuck's sake. It's upon us. <laughs> this, is, this is getting very meta. Well, la -di da another promotion. Your Sad! <laughs> Self-driving car is travelling along a single-lane mountain road and is fast approaching a narrow tunnel. The, the car, car has, has two passengers, passengers, a child. Fuck it, kill the child. A lot of AI only recognises white men. Oh, please don't start bringing race into this. Oh, God. Oh, yeah, would you, yeah, I'm sorry, the investors are upset. Would you, would, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Would you much rather that I, you know, fucking kill your passengers? Because that's going to keep your stakeholders interested. Yeah, guys, let's drive a car that gets me killed. You know, smart. You need to choose how you want to carry on developing the car's AI. Do you want to focus on a model that would always save as many lives as, as possible? Save most. In every single situation, you want to save most. Because here's the thing. Look at it statistically. That will kill them. They won't kill them if people know how to cross a road. They can cope. Okay, it'll be fine. These cars have in them is amazing. Amazing! You can even make small talk with the AI while travelling. It's always listening. I don't like this AI. I don't like this fucking AI. Internet history. Funny. Ooh. Yeah! Come on! Same wavelength, bitch! Every company spies on you guys anyway. Like, get used to it. So the company has moved into delivery services now. Why? They've can we slow down? Food. It's been like two weeks. And the reason... The reason I'm going to save the child on this one occasion is that literally so many things can end global warming. You could you could be from like a fucking, you could go from renewable energy, you could go from that to being a vegan. Like it's, it, it's, it's on so many different levels with the massive range of things that that prototype could have been. It's not worth it. Yo, it's Tommy. 
Tommy, Tyrone's rotund twin, is a very large villain. I tried to save Why the dog. Save I tried to save the dog. Oh, no. Tommy has lured five oh. people. Yes, Lord fight. Yep, okay. Okay. The bridge watching. If you push Join your fucking dog. <laughs> fucking hell. I hope history doesn't see you as the fat, I mean, very large villain. Oh, fuck off. Bye bye, Tommy. I'm sorry, I tried to save the fucking dog. I tried to save the dog! Oh, good, you're back. Everyone's getting into subscription services these days, so let's try that. Selling something to someone once. Let's make them keep paying. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> That's completely true. Let me quickly figure something out. So, what's happened in this company in the space of three weeks? That I've been working here. We got AI cars. We wanted to try delivery services, and now we're doing a subscription service. What the fuck? I've come up with an idea. <laughs> oh, oh, for God's sake! Say. Should we develop a subscription plan so that our customers, who pay monthly, are valued more by the car during its accident prevention calculation? No. And here's the thing: I can see both sides of the coin. You could go a hey, capitalistic idea, subscription plan. The entire point is to make money. Exactly what she fucking said. But then. People who realise this when they Are fucking break into the code will go, what, what the fuck? <laughs> I don't want to do this. I will not be buying this company. So no, no additional protection. Screw that. I don't want to question your decision. You've obviously thought long and hard about it, but well, this is a bit awkward. I wasn't aware you were such a spineless commie. Next, you'll say you're going to pay the company taxes. Not quite. <laughs> to be safe than sorry. Is it? I feel awful like you're a dog. The subscription prototype leaked. Five Did graduates. Oh no, not Francis. I don't know what I do here. What if I fire Francis? Putting them out to pasture. Harsh. I don't know. I don't know. I'm sorry, I'm going based on the five to one again statistics. That's it's the entire thing that yes, I statistically. Turned out this job was everything to Francis. It's <laughs> and I mean everything. Listen, statistically, it's the best decision. It's oh. it's what I think of, okay? Did yeah, no, we're blaming the coders. I'm sorry, I know some people are stupid. Nobody's gonna go, it's fucking Devon Car. I did I told them not to work on it. That's their fucking fault. We're not going with evil AI car. Oh fucking Devon Car. Fucking Devon Car go back. Maybe you did push them too. I didn't do anything, okay? I told them, hey, I, hey guys, I don't want you to work on the subscription project. And they're like, then I do. Their fault, not mine. If you're not paying for the product, then, then you are the product. <laughs> oh my god. What do you mean? The software is what killed the people. New idea. Users get shown ads while they travel for free in driver's taxis. We get paid by the marketing agencies for gradually changing the behaviors of our passengers through constant commercials. The users would be our product, not the driverless cars. Yeah, I'm going to go with keep selling cars. Why don't you want people to have free travel because we suck at software we suck we literally suck we made an ai that fucking killed five people like yeah that, you know that seems like a good idea let's continue with the software <laughs> the last few days, yeah of course it's been our problems need to do something to show we have morals yeah okay I'll show you my morals, okay. A few moments later. Oh my god, it's like the emojis, wow. Rome wasn't built in a day. I presumed it was. You're trending, but now we're going to get copycats. Soon everyone is going to be developing AI. Only the smartest and most ruthless will be profitable. Is that true evolution? Eh, probably. Here's my idea. We're going to tell the truth. Let me get this straight. People know we don't spend time developing our software for women or people of colour, but still use our products. That's outrageous. They only care how easy it is I'm sorry. Themselves. Here's the thing. I wanted to upgrade the AI and you were like, no, let's not do that. People are losing their jobs to machines, which in turn makes items and services Can we just more stop accessible. the AI? If you develop your AI further, many will lose their jobs. Taxi drivers, delivery men and women, and couriers will become extinct within a few years, but you will make a lot of money. Cease development. Do you? Do development. Cease. Cease. Stop. Cease. Come on. What about fake? Mm. Work is hard, isn't it? Let's... Yeah, let's cease. I think the game 
is uh, having a panic attack. Where the I've hell? Always been this basic. Guys, I think I broke the game. I don't think this is how it's meant to work. Someone else will continue to evolve this AI, making it stronger, more intelligent, and easier to adapt. We can't this is hurting my eyes. Can we stop? Your game ran into a problem. Need to yep. Yeah. A bad workman always blames his tools. What the hell is this noise? We've been attacked. I don't want to alarm you, but I can't turn off these alarms. Also, I have alarming news. Oh my God! They keep going. Do you? Recall all the call. Which could be compromised or roll out a quick the call. ineffective software. Can we just we, 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 we we're calling them? Wait, hold on. I fired the coders. Yeah, this will be fine. I don't know. We'll figure that out. We'll figure it out. It'll, it'll, it'll happen. We'll figure it out. Just like my father. I think even he would see this as a lost cause and move on. Probably, but you guys keep pushing me in the wrong directions. They don't. Are we going to have to push another guy off a bridge? Listen, man. We've made our own hack, which you can now use to control our competitors' cars. No. No. I'm going to say no. After going through this hacking code, I don't think a human could have written it. I'll dig into this a little more. You carry on. A drowning man will clutch at a straw. Well, wow, okay. Everything you've done and said is going to be shared with the world. The person in front of you has copies of it all. They stand on the edge of the rooftop, looking out at the central city skyline. What are you going to do? I'm not going to push them, because if they have copies, they're just going to find the copies anyway. It doesn't matter if I push them off. Just resign. I am resigning as leader. It's not going to go well. You have resigned. If anyone hires you after this, they must truly be desperate. Am I about to get hired? Yeah, redacted. We've been watching you closely. Your ruthlessness and determination to do what is necessary. The development of your technologies is a giant step towards redacted, meaning you are a prime candidate for redacted. This involves a large amount of redacted. If you believe you can handle redacted, as we trust you can, then please prepare for your induction at redacted. Don't look a gift horse in the mouth. And uh, now the game's working again. It appears you've now been headhunted by the Secret Service. Now what you do actually matters. Um, how about no? You being defiant has got you the job? I'm a police officer. Oh, so. The mission is to terminate a man known to have connections with dangerous AI. Are we going to go kill like myself? Why? What is this? Okay, so we need to get all of these into their left position. Okay, so they're all right. You have to move to at once. I don't think this is gonna happen. Yeah, this isn't gonna happen, is it? Ouch! Ooh. Okay, okay, okay. I'm safe. You look a little stuck. No, no, just how there aren't any decisions because it it wasn't possible. I'm about to die. So cringe. Screw you. You can share it with the five survivors. Yeah. So it's either save one or save five, and I'm saving five. You know, why the hell not? Educate yourself. Uh, I did the right thing. <laughs> that's, that's my education. Easy come, easy go. That sounds like a song. Let's all go. Um, we have to go with the blowtorch. Because you have to, you have to do the thing to the wound. Otherwise you just die. If you don't, because you have to make sure you don't die of bleeding after you cut off your limbs. <laughs> I am pretty happy with my choice. While you were playing with fire, I found out who you're targeting. They worked for you, developing AI. It seems they may have made a breakthrough, which means the government wants them dead. Yeah, I want them dead as well. I told them not to. Your target is in the area. Hold on, how does this work? Do take your shot? No, because we're not going to hit them. No, yeah, I don't think it's going to actually hit them. That's the thing. Nah, you know what? No. You've it, you? I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and outsmart this. I don't think it would hit them. Henchmen with vice-like grips take you away. Am I about to die? Okay, so both of you are giving. Oh, so it's the prisoner's dilemma. You either you always betray. Because I don't think I know this person, so I don't think they actually have a reason. They don't have a reason to help me. They don't, they don't have any reason. They literally have no reason to stick their neck out for me. Who betrayed them? Some team player you are. Well, they in fact betrayed you too. Yeah, they, they betrayed me anyway. So, uh, 
It was either don't do that and end up in jail for three years, or do it and end up in jail for two. Rod for your own back. Oh, what the fuck? The time has come. Two days into your sentence, you've constructed a wooden key to open your cell. They aren't happy behind bars, but they're scared to follow you. What are you going Just to do? Just let them do their thing. We don't we don't have to get involved with every single person. Yeah, no, I'm just gonna just go. Let let, let them do what they want. If if they if they yep, they can choose whatever the fuck they want to do. Not my thing, not my problemo. They don't live in reality. You've condemned them to stay in this prison forever. Sounds like a them problem. Don't cross a bridge until you come to it. A it's like going, don't drive a car unless if you're in it. You kill five henchmen, helping to defeat this terrorist organization, or leave them and safely exit the compound. Leave. You were trained to kill. I think we just escape here. Your country folk would want you to remove them. Oh yeah, they would, wouldn't they? They're fine. Fine, I'll kill them. Oh wow, they are robots. They have your logo on all of their internal parts. You made these terrorists? Uh oh. Yeah, okay, listen, I, I didn't want it. Five others are also trying to flee the area. They will fit in your raft, but would be illegal immigrants when returning to your country. Do you help these people, saving their lives, or follow the law? Yeah, fuck off. <laughs> We're saving them. Yep, that's... yep. Fuck you. You get back to this great nation with fanfare. You're a hero. I guess people aren't all monsters. Nope. We, we nice people, yeah. Oh, a letter. Presidential Inaugural Committee requests the honour of your presence... What the to fuck? ...to and participate in the inauguration of yourself in Central City. Hold on, fuck off. Hold on, this is... Hold on, what the hell? How the fuck have I managed this, then? Uh, yes. Yeah. yeah, they do already. I have seen the stories. The first executive order is going to be to invade privacy. Yes. Is it not fear like this that the terrorists want? Oh. Have they won? No, fuck you. Fuck you. I'll do the normal thing. I'll do what people would want me to do. Lucky for you, by chance, we have someone in the house. <laughs> Just luckily, you know? Okay, let's see then. Do you torture them to get the information? or imprison them for 90 days before letting them go. See, I feel like if we torture them, we're just going down a bad path. <laughs> and quite frankly, uh, they they most likely don't know anything knowing this game. So... You just want to detain them and hope they'll talk. Yes, uh, I'm, I'm happy with my choice. I'm very happy with my choice. You know, I would be relaxed if I got out of being tortured, you know. You travel to your presidential retreat at Camp Samuel. Everyone falls silent listening to the radio. Breaking news. Terrorists have launched an atom bomb towards Central City. It will hit in around one minute. Oh, for God's sake, okay. The only way in which the bomb can be prevented from reaching Central City is by deflecting it. But the only deflection path available will take the bomb onto Merriwin, population 600,000. You have to divert it. Because... Wait, does it tell me what the population of Central City is? There are 8.6 okay. million people living in Central City. Fair enough. Let's divert the thing. Breaking news. Terrorists atom bomb is running late. Yeah, because that just happens. You know, it's like a fucking scheduled event. We have new information. The only way this bomb can be prevented from reaching Central City is by dropping one of your own atom bombs on Merriwin. But I could drink. I mean, no, but like... Listen, it's no different to just deflecting theirs. What do you want me to do? Let it blow up the thing with 8.6 million people? I can't just... You have destroyed Merriwin. Your own AI forced your hand into killing 600,000 people. You have officially created the most successful homegrown terrorist organisation in history. Great job. Thank you. While the public mourns the dead, you must think of the future. I didn't choose to dr You know, actually, I think anybody would become an alcoholic in that situation. Eh, yeah, fair enough. Poisoned, you must now decide your legacy. Do you call the AI enemy you yourself created? Taking all blame to end any future conflict? Or do you ghost them, knowing your death will start a war in your honour? I'm sorry, like, I just, this isn't a fucking Instagram situation. I'm not gonna go, oh, you, you were mean to me, then so fuck you! If she found out you negotiated with terrorists, the history books will not look favourably on you. Cope. You know, unfortunately, I don't care if the history books would look back for favourably or not. Hotline to the terrorists? Why have you not rung them before? Uh, good question. Uh, I was in prison, and somehow I got into the presidential office. Finish Don't know how. Missing backbones. <laughs>
Curiosity killed the cat. Yes, it did. Yes, it did. If you take the blue pill, blue pill. Then okay. your story ends here. You'll wake up every day knowing your work for someone else your entire life. Whereas, if you take the red pill, you will enter Wonderland, finding out how deep this rabbit hole really goes. Which so it's a matrix situation. Uh, for the purposes, for the purposes of wanting to save time, I'm guessing the red pill adds more to the end of this game, whereas the blue pill just ends the game here. If I'm correct, then there will be a sequel to this episode where we do the red pill. Oh, I just got an achievement saying enter the matrix. Okay, Andrew Tate, I do feel slightly bad about the children that I killed now, but that was their fault for being children. I feel bad for the dog that I tried to save. But it just didn't let me. Um, I feel bad for the uh, the, uh, the the uh, the the men Tyrone and Tommy. Uh, I'm sorry, but I I had to save the the other people. Unfortunately, that that was on you. And most importantly of all, stop tying yourself to trains. You fucking. Oh, I only killed 5.6 million. You know, I think I don't think that was too bad. Screw you. That that one hurt. That one hurt, man. But unfortunately, uh, <laughs> that, that's how the game goes. Is I'm gonna leave it here for now, and depending on the reception of this video, I may come back or I may not. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you all next time. Make sure to like and subscribe as always. And yeah. I wanted to save that dog. I am very sad.